Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. My name is TBR Schmidt, and this is my wife, Samantha. Hello. And today we are watching Speed. What do you know about this movie? It has Keanu Reeves. Keanu Reeves. And Sandra Bullock. And Sandra Bullock, a perfect pair. Yeah, two of my favorites. I've talked about on the channel how much I love Sandra Bullock. Yeah. Um, we got to see her in Demolition Man. Yep. And I don't think we've seen Keanu on the channel yet. So I'm excited, um, heard great things about this. This one hour action Patreon poll. Yeah, so we would like to thank all our patrons for voting for this to win our action Patreon poll. By just a sliver. Very close. <laughs> so it just beat out The Fugitive, which we will actually be watching as well yeah. in like a week or so. They're they're too close. Yeah, they're too close <laughs> for us, so we'll do, do them both. Yeah. So if you'd like to see the full length reaction to this, as well as everything else that we've reacted to, the link to our Patreon is in the description. If you'd like to interact with us on our Instagrams, Twitch, or Twitter, all those links are in the description as well. And with that, let's get into the movie. Oh, oh Dennis Hopper. Dennis Hopper. We just saw him in uh, True Romance. Mm -hmm. We're going way down. It's pretty intense. It looks like uh, like word art. <laughs> Jeff Daniels. Okay. Who's that? Um, wouldn't know what. You've seen him in. I'll probably see him or recognize him when I see him. We're only in the basement. I guess we start at the top of like a skyscraper or mm. something. I'm gonna have to see a work order. <laughs> oh my. Holy shit. I thought he was gonna get shot so and I I. stabbed in the ear. What was that guy messing with? You think the elevators? Oh, maybe. The light's on, but you never know it really might be broken. Shut up. Uh-oh. Oh, they're all dead. Okay, I guess they have like an automatic break. I think that's a fear I didn't know that I had. Right? Oh, that's oh. the car. <laughs> the car's 100% destroyed. <laughs> oh, okay. So he's like, uh. Bombs? Yeah, what? bomb defusal. So that's Jeff Daniels. Bomb's already taken out cables. Bomber wants $3 million or he blows the emergency brakes. 23 minutes exactly. So Harry volunteers to examine the device. Yeah, right. Fine. And everyone else, I want you to confirm building evac. He was in Terminator 2, I think. He's also the dad of that one like lawyer show. I don't know, you used to watch this like- Oh, a uh, scandal. Yeah. 32. So Dennis Hopper's our madman? Yeah. Oh, well, we already saw him. Yeah. He's not gonna be happy about this. No. Help! Definitely didn't anticipate this being about elevators. <laughs> I assume it's like a car chase or something was the speed. Yeah, this is not good. I'm definitely gonna think about my elevator exploding the next time I'm in an elevator. What's going on? There's been an elevator malfunction. So just relax. Oh yeah, he just blow this up at any time. Shoot the hostage. What? Take her out of the equation. Clear shot. You deeply not seen that. <laughs> Jeez. Shoot the hostage. <laughs> so he's kind of a, like a little wild card. Maybe we can do something about those hostages. We're not gonna shoot them, right? <laughs> Take him out of the equation. What's going on? Don't leave us Even here. more explosives down there? He's in the other elevator? Uh, yeah, I think he's on the other side. Oh, we just take them out of the equation. Gonna hook them on to yeah. that? Maybe, yeah, get him to hold on to that and just drop the elevator or something. Give me long enough? Yeah. Can't get any more time. He's not talking. I need the goddamn money now. Why did I take this job? 30 more years of this, you get a tiny pension and a cheap gold watch. <laughs> 
Cool. Cool. Well, I guess if the bombs blow up the brakes, as long as this holds the elevator up, yeah, they don't need fine. to. Yeah. Oh, how convenient. Right? <laughs> don't fuck with daddy. Oh, man. This better hold. Oh, my God. Oh, that's not holding very well. Usually they fall down now. Usually? Yeah, great insight. Bitches early. Yeah, he just blew that up before time. Oh no. Okay, it's time to get them out. <laughs> yeah. I don't even know what floor they're on, right? I don't. I mean, maybe you can figure it out. Oh, they're like at a weird spot. That's it, go on. It's okay. Give me your hand. Somebody's gonna get freaking cut in half. Ooh. Oh, they have more space now. Oh, shit. Watch, watch your head. Watch your head. Watch your head. Go. Fucking go. Fuck. <laughs> Oh my Run out, God. guys. Go, go, go. Sorry. I'm so afraid of someone getting cut in half. Watch your head, watch your head. I don't think they're gonna get everyone. No. Lady, move. Holy shit. Why were they standing right there? He jumped the gun. We had three minutes left. Why does he do that? He's losing his three million. No, because he's there. He's here. He knew we were up to something. He's close by. Not gonna corner himself in a building. He's literally in the elevator. The elevators. Passenger cars were stopped. They checked them out. Maintenance. Great elevators. Dang. And he was putting another bomb in that one too. Ooh, I don't like that holding. Mr. Guest, please sign in. What? <laughs> what, what are you saying? Damn it. No, he's definitely gonna hear this. Very quiet. Yeah. Holy shit. Oh no. Oh shit. Uh oh. Can I crush him? Yeah. How much space do you think it leaves at the top? That's not nothing. There's a hole. Yeah, he needs to squeeze through that hole. I don't suppose anybody will give me three million just for you. <laughs> oh. Pop quiz, hot shot. Terrace holding a police hostage. He's got enough dynamite. Oh, no. There's going to be 50 cops waiting for you in the basement. Well, maybe we'll get off on the third floor. Huh? We've got movement on the freight elevator. Thank you. At least someone else knows. So we have cameras on every other elevator except for the freight. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> Say goodbye, Harry. Oh. He really did. You fuck. <laughs> Shoot him. Freeze. <laughs> well, I think if he drops it, it's still gonna blow up, right? <laughs> <laughs> what a crazy laugh. Oh my God. I thought he was going to be around for like the whole movie. <laughs> Affected the rescue of 13 citizens of this city. Well, he saved his friend. Oh shit. He's still alive? Yeah. Just blew his hand up or was his hand always like that? I think his hand was always like that. All right. I feel good about myself. Here we go. Hey Sandy! Here we go. And now he knows their names. <laughs> to Jack. For shooting Harry. <laughs> Here's to you guys. For doing your job. 
and for not getting dead. We got the bad guy, and we didn't lose any civilian. Why do they think they got the bad guy? Wouldn't there be just pieces of him everywhere? Luck runs out sooner or later. Right, Chief? That's right. This dark. Yeah, I mean, he did just get shot. I'm gonna go home, have some sex. <laughs> have some sex. Is that the bus driver who just left the bus there? He's getting some coffee. See you tomorrow. Oh no! Aww. Jeez. A payphone? Yeah, is there a payphone ringing? There's a bomb on a bus. Once the bus goes 50 miles an hour, bomb is armed. If it drops below 50, it blows up. Take any passengers off the bus. I will detonate it. I want my money by 11 a.m. 11 a.m.? The number of the bus is 2525. Is at the corner of Ocean Park. Jeez. Can you get to it before it hits 50? Where is the bus going to go 50, though? On the, the freeway. freeway? Well, there's our bus. First time in LA. <laughs> oh, this guy. Oh no, I live here. No, I mean mine. It's not like I can hide it. <laughs> not really. <laughs> Don't talk to me. Oh man, oh, it's already on the freeway. Oh, they haven't hit 50 yet. Money isn't everything. Yeah, right. Come on, where's the traffic? <laughs> right? I mean, he's going fast. Stop! Oh, traffic's about to open up. Oh, shit, he already... No! Where's your badge? Oh, he had it in his hand. My car, I own this car, it's not stolen. It is now. <laughs> it is now. <laughs> Toon man. I think your car is fucked. No. Look, man, we don't have to go so fast, all right? Just slow down a little. <laughs> <laughs> boop, 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 boop. <laughs> flipping him off. Man sure has a hard on for this bus. <laughs> no. That's it. I'm a cop! LAPD! Stop the What? <laughs> He's like, what? I want you to ride on the back bomb on bus. Ride it, ride it, ride it! Oh my god. Oh, he's gonna be pissed. Watch the road, huh? Oh, shit. Oh. <laughs> Don't. No, 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 no. no. Yeah, he has to be able to tell he's going over 50. No! Don't slow down! Speed! Speed! Open the door! Open the fucking door, man! 50! Stay above 50! God. The 8,000 asked for Detective Harry Temple. Harry, it's Jack. <laughs> he had a rough night. The bomber! He's back! Dead terrorist says he's rigged the city bus. Where's Jack? Where do you think? <laughs> yeah, yeah, you get on the bus. <laughs> yeah, get Give out of my, my car. car back. <laughs> Are you insured? Yeah, why? What? Broke my, my door. <laughs> it's already convertible. Did he need to do that? <laughs> I don't think so. He could have just jumped out. <laughs> oh, <shit>. <laughs> Tourist. <laughs> Come on. Ooh. Oh. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh. oh no, poor dude. All right, he's okay. Just a little wet. Damn, he didn't have a seatbelt on or anything. <laughs> I'm Jack Trabin, LAPD. We have a slight situation on the bus here. You're scaring the shit out of these people. Ma'am, please. We should be able to defuse the problem. So sit tight. Get away from me. What the hell, dude? Probably thinks he's there for him. Whatever you did, I'm sure that you're sorry. 
So it's cool now. It's over. It's cool. We're just two cool guys just hanging out. Oh, 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 oh no, citizens are. Oh no. No! You slow down and this bus will explode! Well, yeah. That was a way to let people know. Didn't really have a choice. So you're a cop, right? I should probably tell you that I'm taking the bus because I have my driver's license for folks. Oh no. What for? Speeding. Hey, that works. How many times did she get <laughs> caught speeding to have her driver's license revoked? Quite a few. Got quite a few channels pulled up. Check the speedometer. Has it been fucked with or loosened or any wires? <laughs> no, it's clean. Huh? <laughs> it's... <laughs> Access panel. In the floor. Oh. Underneath you, mate. You can get underneath the bus. Take this. I want you to tell them what I see. I'm just a tourist. Brass fittings. Brass fittings. Oh, that looks big and fancy. Fuck me. Oh, darn. <laughs> <laughs> Can't really see a cellular Officer. remote and a timer running off a wristwatch. Oh, no. Watch. Are they going to hit traffic? Yeah, something's coming up. A gold watch for retirement. Officer! <laughs> what do I do? What do I do? What do I... Which way? Which way? Get on the shoulder. Yeah, they need to, like, map out their path and, like, block off traffic for them to, like, maybe do, like, a loop or something. Stay on again. Oh, just keep your foot on the gas. Why did I not know those things were full of water? Oh, no? No, I thought they were like cement. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> She's doing all right. <laughs> Every single car. How is she not flipped? Oh. Good thing this thing's a tank. He's an encyclopedia of bombs, he knows every kind. Yeah, and everything we do to dismantle. Yeah, is he a retired bomb squad guy and got a shitty gold watch in his retirement? I want to look at cops. Yeah, you called that. Yeah, it's like the shitty gold retirement watch. I had to bail on the freeway. Just keep going straight. I'm going to try to clear the roads. Yes. Oh. Oh, Jesus. God. Oh. Oh, Jesus. Good job. Yeah. Mac, you gotta get me out of here. Oh no. Let's just throw a baby in front of the bus. Hold straight. I've got some units waiting for you there. Be empty. You'll be totally clear. Got it. There's a whole freeway not in use. I guess under construction or something. A few blocks. We take a soft turn to the right. Oh, this baby's gonna fuck up that plan. Wait a minute. Wait. Escort to where? Where do we get an escort? Oh, oh my. my god. Oh my god. There was no baby, okay. it was full of cat. <laughs> He's smiling. <laughs> Why was the police escort so far ahead of them? That is a dead end. There's a turn. I can't make that turn. You can make it. You're right. We're going to tip over. Everyone on this side of the. Oh my god. All right, please. You can. please. <laughs> Put the blinkers on. <laughs> oh, that is a hard the ride. The cops can barely make it. Oh, here we go. Oh. Here we go. Oh. Oh shit! That's like five feet off. Oh, <laughs> jeez. Take me to that interchange at the 105. Interchange. Whoa, get out of its way. I can't think. It's okay. If you need to, you go right ahead and vomit. <laughs> what a nice guy. How long is the 105? I don't know, right? It needs to be like a long stretch. I want you to start going through the pension fund. This guy's drawing disability. I want pictures. I've seen this asshole. 
Yeah, at least you can identify them right when they see a picture. So are more people getting on? Yeah, I don't know. You think maybe he's a cop. He's on the line for you. Give him the number. How's he doing? Bleeding his last fella. Maybe they can negotiate to get him off? Yeah. If we died, they gotta take a pay cut. <laughs> I mean, you know. You know. <laughs> Not the best joke. We're gonna get the driver off. Just him? For now. Gigantor. Gigantor? <laughs> How you feeling? I got pissed shot. Thank you, Sam. Okay, Ed. Man, I would get shot to get off the bus. I don't think this is an ongoing <laughs> agreement. A little closer, Eddie. Stay above 50. Go up, go up. Ah. <laughs> oh my god. That was a victory. Yeah. I feel like this lady's gonna lose her. Yeah, she's gonna like jump off the bus. <sighs> He's gonna be okay. Oh, yep. oh no, is she going right now? No, Helen! No, Helen, no! Go to the right. No, go. she's going to fall on the ground then. Who cares? No, no. Oh, shit. She got blown up and run over. Interactive TV, Jack, wave of the future. <laughs> oh, my God. Yeah, they need to get rid of all of those cameras. I thought that was it. I thought that was a bomb. And then when I saw her body fall under the bus. You were glad you were still alive. Mm-hmm. That was an interesting spin on why she was like crying. It wasn't just that ran somebody over. Yeah, it was more that she was actually happy that she's not dead. Yeah. The aerial unit got it about three miles ahead. There's a section missing. What? Well, no wonder the freeway was closed, right? Yeah, I guess it's under construction. Fuck. You're fired. Everybody's fucking fired. <laughs> How big is the section? 50 feet at least. 50 feet? Are they going to jump it? How do you jump 50 feet? There's a gap in the freeway. What? A couple of miles ahead. This is crazy. A couple of miles, you're gonna hit this in a few minutes. Oh my god, Jack! What? Oh, they're jumping it. When we hit the gap, heads down. That's it? That's your plan? Yeah, they can't stop and turn around. Hey, I didn't mean to shoot the guy. Is this really gonna work? Hopefully. They're gonna lose everybody else though. All of their support outside. Yes, you're right. They all have to stop. Oh my god. Holy shit. She better get this thing going real fast. That's not that much of a decline. And that's a, a no, curve. There's no, there's no fucking way. Oh god. Don't slow down. He is not doing well. No. Thank you. Thank you very much. She hit her head? I think so. Ooh. Ooh. Get off this. Now, now, get off this. Oh. Runway? Yeah, go to the airport. Oh, and they can't fly over. True. The news people. Hey, hey, stop! Have you not been watching the news people? Oh, no! Fuck, that's a problem. There's only one of the back ones, right? I think so. Maybe we'll circle the runways and buy some time. The choppers can't fly in there with restricted airspace. Yes. I watch enough high speed pursuits to know that. <laughs> the runway. Yeah, let's hope it's built. Let's move. Yeah, unfortunately, if this was real, we would be glued to the TV. <laughs> that flat's gonna be a problem. You want the money, I don't want anyone else to die. Let me get on the ground. That's not against the rules. All right. He said yeah. passengers can't get off. Which also the bus driver should not have been included. Don't forget about us. That was so clean. <laughs> <laughs> it's probably a lot easier in a SUV than a giant oversized trailer. trailer. He's been a step ahead every time. If we unload, he'll take them out, I guarantee. I have to try and dismantle that bomb. You need to get under there. Yeah, and he needs to find a way to like hook underneath it. Circling the runway. So the choppers are gone, but I wonder if they can still get the camera angle from the ground. Probably depends where, because LAX is massive. What is that? I 
have no idea. They're gonna stick him under like with that? Yeah. Okay, Jack, this is it. Don't get dead. Don't get dead. What they happens? had a lot of trust in that going straight back. Yeah, what happens when they turn? Not a very good plan. <laughs> Fate sister. Also, is he gonna fit under there? Oh, that looks like a tight squeeze. Can you find the tripwire for the remote? Harry, it's covered. Yeah, I know. You're gonna have to cut off the sheath, but don't cut the wire. Oh no, the flat. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, Howard Payne. Oh. Small charge left him with Inger's numbering nine. That's our scumbag! <laughs> I want you to get out of there and sit tight. We're gonna go after the source. Watch your back. Oh no. Who's to say he's not just gonna blow it up? I feel like he's not there. Somebody go to the back and check and see if he came out the back. They're gonna have to pull him up from that panel under. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. He's not back here! Oh my God. Get away from that tire. Uh-oh. Oh no. Oh fuck. Now they're gonna run out of fuel. Everyone just screaming. Oh, oh man. How many lives you got, man? You got some big round hairy corners. Very gross, Ortiz. Very gross, Ortiz. We're leaking gas? We are now. Oh, that's going down fast. No, get a fuel car out here on the double. Right. He's like, I heard him. <laughs> They can refuel in the air. They should be able to do a bus on the road. He's pretty close to the airport. But also, if you like startle him, do you not think that he's just gonna like push the button? Right, just blow it up anyways. No, we have your money. <laughs> no, guys, get out of here. Was that a radio? Yeah. garbage can in the northeast corner. You drop the bags and leave. And if they drop the money in there, can't they just get him? Later? Like, yeah, because he's gonna have to go get the money. I'll be dead. Arizona Wildcat. Oh, he keeps calling her Wildcat. Let's just keep looking straight ahead. So he's got a camera on board, or? Called you a wildcat before I didn't even pick up on him. He's been playing me for minute one. Yeah, well, he, he can see me, but can he hear me? Oh man, can they somehow mess with this video feed? So it looks like everyone's still on the bus? Now you can broadcast your Everybody's UHF, right? Yeah, sure. There's a signal going to that bus, so I want you to find it. Hurry up. Good, tape off of that. And then just loop that. Tape it, good, come on, tape it. It's taping. You almost out of gas. Oh no. I want you to make a tape and loop it so that it runs over and over, okay? Tapes rolling. Oh, perfect timing. <laughs> uh, but it's only a minute of footage. That's just gonna loop over and over, so. I know. It's not that much time. He'll notice eventually. Yeah. Working. It's working so far. They gotta hurry up. Come on, buddy. I got you. Yeah. You have so much more to see, man. Freaking tires. Oh my god. Oh, is this their way out? Whoa! <laughs> Where's this bus going? Where's it gonna explode? Um, hopefully no one's on that. Oh my god. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. 
Okay, it's over. It's over, Annie. You did it. Man, Annie was like the best driver. <laughs> yeah. You should take care of it. Ow! Watch it. Sorry. He wants to know when he's gonna get his money. He doesn't know it blew up. 30 minutes. Then they should plant an empty bag. Yeah, they have nothing to lose now. Yeah. Or they're just gonna search every area around here. That can see <laughs> that green bin. Are you sure the pink bomb is in with the money? It's done, sir. What time is it? They had till 11, right? Yeah. Did they just stop the ambulance? <laughs> Made the drop. They are very obvious. Baz Jackie could have made a good cop. Was that intentional, though, to be that obvious? Oh! No! oh. Ah, shit! Oh, no. She has no idea what he looks like. Can't be this close out. You need to move back. Oh, no. Jack Travin. Jack Travin, yes. Oh, no. Annie's been through enough. Turn it on. Has Just do it. Shit, it's, it's moving. moving. He's got the money. Jack! Is there a hole in that trash can? He's close. It's just he has Annie, yeah. a hostage. Is he gonna shoot her? <laughs> Turn around! Oh no. You're crazy. In that door now, punk! Oh shit. Now they're around all these people. Get in! You get back in there! Doesn't have a very great escape plan. Jeez, from a bus to a subway. Oh, okay. When you explode, that's where they'll come, but that's not where I'll be. It's not gonna hurt any. So he's gonna blow her up no matter what. Yeah. So he can get away. How do you get up? How do you get up there? I have no idea. Hey, Jack, is that you? Ooh. Wouldn't be able to interest you in a bribe, would I? Plenty to go around. Ah, you bastard! Did he not think that there was paint in the money? <laughs> oh, oh, Jack. Oh, How the what? shit. How'd you get up there? I better not let go of this trigger. Does he have a hold on it? Ooh. You just decapitate him? Yeah. Well, I'm taller. <laughs> By a whole head. <laughs> Where's Payne? He lost his head. <laughs> Just le left her handcuffed. Try the emergency brake. Jack, you need to copy. Uh, get her loose. Can't stop it? Okay, well, undo me and I'd love to go with you. Come on. Doesn't have the keys. I don't have a key. What? Break her hands off. <laughs> I'm sure she'd rather be alive. <laughs> Are they just gonna die together? Come on. I'm gonna speed it up. I could jump the track. Jump a bus now, jump a subway? That works, but you can't use the emergency brake. <laughs> no. <laughs> you can only do speed. Is that like an axe in here? It's like in case of danger, in case right? Of fire, in case of whatever. <laughs> in case of madman bomber. Oh, it's going fast. Oh, yes. Oh my God. <laughs> Jeez. Hey. She got out. Yeah, the pipe's broken. Space Odyssey. <laughs> Got Starline Tours is the tourist on this. You didn't leave me. Didn't have anywhere to be just then. And she still has handcuffs on. Check it out. They're like, what the hell? I 
like herd relationships based on intense. <laughs> we'll have to base it on sex then. <laughs> Whatever you say, man. <laughs> Quite a morning these two have had. They're just getting showered by glass. Oh, wow. Although I do feel like they miss an opportunity to put the tourist guy on the Starline Tours bus. <laughs> you think the first thing he did when he got off of that bus was get on a tour? Yeah, he just wanted a sightsee. <laughs> All right, that was speed. What'd you think? I loved it. That was so much fun. That was a lot of fun. It was very exciting. Had a little too much coffee, so <laughs> I feel like I was like very on edge. I mean, yes. even without coffee, this movie was just nonstop. <laughs> yeah, I mean, Keanu Reeves and Sandra Bullock had great chemistry. Yeah, and it reminds me, I've seen an interview, I think they were at different times, they were both on Ellen, and they talked about how they both had crushes on each other oh. during this movie, but they no one acted on it. Oh so my we God. missed we missed having Keanu and Sandra being together this whole time. That's unfortunate. It's unfortunate because they're perfect together. That, yeah. They would have been the absolute most power couple Hollywood has ever had, I feel like. Oh, what a missed opportunity. But that was amazing. Yeah, no, I loved it. I feel like Dennis Hopper was an incredible villain. Yeah. He was very intelligent and the right amount of like kind of crazy eccentric. Yeah, you know, he's rich, so he's eccentric. <laughs> but the demise of Howard was <laughs> much more than I had anticipated. You know, we saw like a good amount of violence um, and some blood just with like the gunshots. Um, the first guy who got stabbed in the head. Yeah, that was like a very abrupt start. Yeah. I was not uh, anticipating a decapitation. No, I figured the likely ending would be somehow getting the bomb near him without him thinking that it's near him. Yeah, and then and, he, like, would... he would like try to detonate it and then kill himself. Yeah. I, if I had to guess, that's how he would go out. Yeah. But having him decapitated up there. Well, Keanu Reeves is just like holding his like. <laughs> no, but I'm taller. So. Oh, that line. There was, uh, you know, a couple of totally 90s cheesy lines in it, yeah. which I feel like just made it that much better. Yeah, they were perfectly incorporated. Yeah. I mean, I loved it. Um, I really liked Sam, who was the driver. Um, oh, yeah, the first driver. Yeah, I feel like he was great. I feel like a lot of people on the bus were great. I mean, you also had... Gi oh, yeah, it was Ortiz. Yeah. His name... They were calling him Gigantor, I think. Gigantor. Because he was gigantic. Yeah. But I feel like there was just so many things that kind of kept happening. Even at the end there, as soon as Howard was like, donezo, I kind of figured like, okay, cool. That's the end of the film. And then they throw in the fact that the subway's going to end. Right. And then Annie is totally stuck still to that pole. Yeah. Um. So I feel like just things kept happening. Yeah, no, I mean, it didn't stop until the very end. Mm -hmm. There was one thing after another, but yeah, no, I really enjoyed the chemistry of everyone on the bus as well. They had a little bit of everything. I mean, they had a criminal on there who thought that Jack was there for him. They had- That was actually, I think that was pretty funny. That was really funny. Yeah. And it led to, say that action led to Annie being the driver of the bus. Right, yeah, because then he shoots Sam. And then it also, Kind of inadvertently maybe led to that woman being killed because she tried to get off the bus when they were getting Sam off the bus. Yeah, that was rough. I mean, I was thinking that Annie should have, I said right, but I guess from her perspective, she should have swerved to the left so that she couldn't get, get, off. get off. But what the hell is that one cop doing who was like, give me your hand. Like, you know shouldn't, the rules, yeah, dude. Yeah. Everyone yeah. should have been clued in that no one else gets off the bus. Yeah. But I was not. I thought maybe she would swerve or maybe she would fall yeah. or whatever, but I was not expecting like a mini bomb to blow up by the door. By the door and then for her to get run over by the bus. Yeah, no, that was brutal. Yeah. And I think, I mean, that goes to Howard's character and how intelligent he is. Like that was a rule of not letting anyone leave the bus. So for him to have like rigged a mini bomb right there, like attention yeah. to detail for sure. I mean, he had been planning it for a while, like how he wasn't at home. Now, obviously at some point they were going to figure out who he was. So he had his house rigged to explode. I mean, I feel like he hadn't really been planning this. I mean, he said that he planned that elevator scheme for like two years. Yeah. This 
seemed like it was like a couple, a couple days. Of weeks, yeah, maybe. a couple days after I guess, the whole elevator thing. I guess um, Harry had to recover from the gunshot wound and stuff. So maybe a couple of weeks or but a he month. He was on or death so. duty still, and he saw his cane. Yeah, that's true. So not that much time, but I mean, obviously very proficient with explosives and stuff. So if he knows how they're going to deactivate or defuse them, he can kind of counter that. So he was a great psycho villain. Yes. Um, and everyone on the bus was great. I mean, we had Ortiz with his like a citizen's arrest moment <laughs> that went bad. Uh, we had The Tourist, uh, which you haven't seen the movie, but I think it's coming up soon, Ferris Bueller's Day Off. Uh, currently winning our poll. So he, The Tourist is a main character in that movie. Okay. He was great. I mean, there were so many different characters on the bus that were either afraid or they were helpful or they were panicking themselves. So it wasn't just centered around Jack and Annie. There was mm -hmm. a dynamic with everyone. And, mm -hmm. and when they would succeed, everyone would be excited and stuff. Like when they would make a turn or jump over the the uh, whatever incomplete bridge. Yeah, I feel like just it did pile on the issues, but it never felt like you were like, oh, come on. Like how many things could go wrong? Everything seemed to kind of lead into something more. Maybe a little bit at the end there when like they already dealt with a bridge not being finished and now they're dealing with the subway not being finished. It was like, okay. That's the one part where it was like, okay, that was a little bit of a stretch, but I feel like the rest of the movie, it was so exciting and mm -hmm. so entertaining, but it was very simple. So there was plenty of times where like, well, this is the next logical step. And then that is what happened. Yeah. Like when there's traffic, we kind of commented like they need to start blocking off roads. Well, they did that. Yep. When they went to the airport and they ran over to get a flat tire because of those spikes, like, okay, those would be at the airport. Mm -hmm. You commented on the no fly zone over the airport. So mm -hmm. that killed the cameras. Right. That's exactly what happened. So it's like, yeah. everything was very simple, very logical, but that didn't change the fact that it was extremely exciting. Yeah, no, very exciting. I also wanted to comment on Captain McMahon. Yeah. Tom Morton was fantastic. I feel like um, him and Harry, Jeff Daniels. Yeah, Harry was great too. Yeah, I feel like Jack, Captain McMahon, Harry, like they all made like a great team. And from the beginning, like you're really getting that relationship between Jack and Harry in the elevator and their kind of banter back and forth, the whole pop quiz thing, yeah. shooting the hostage, which <laughs> right. at first we're like, what the fuck? But <laughs> then he does end up having to shoot Harry and it's like, that worked. <laughs> all right. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I really did like Captain McMahon, mm -hmm. especially that one time when they find out that the bridge is not, like, not complete and he's like, you're all fired. <laughs> It's like, it's complete on the map. <laughs> I know, and that just took me back to like, kind of put me in the place of this film. Not the place, I guess the time of the film. You're seeing like the technology of the cell phones and the car phones and all of that stuff. But the map just like kind of took me out. Cause it's like, I mean, I guess if for as long as we've been driving, yeah. really, we've never had to deal with maps. Right, you just, plug in an address on your phone and it says, turn left, turn right, here's the traffic, here's the time. Like, yeah, like I guess the only thing pre would still be like a, what, a Tom Tom. Yeah, like which some older. I st we still didn't need to deal with that. So it's just funny to see that like, that's what did it. it was, well, it's complete on the map. Yeah, on this piece of paper map, you know, <laughs> if they had an, an iPhone, they would be like, oh shit, we gotta pick a different route yeah, this here. Yeah, closed. <laughs> it wouldn't even take you that way. <laughs> right. Um, so that was really interesting. I'm also not familiar with the 105 I don't know. freeway. So that kind of added some excitement because I was like, I have no idea how long this freeway even is. Yeah. I mean, there was still enough mystery mm -hmm. of like, how are they going to get around this traffic? They're going to run out of time. The tire is going to be flat. They're running out of gas. Like they can't get anyone off. I mean, it really, it was like every couple of minutes they introduced like a new layer even like i think obstacle yeah. yeah i think even Anthony commented on it was like oh did you need this to be more difficult like yeah i feel like one of the most exciting parts for me was when jack is going underneath the bus yeah annie is just like panicking because she's like where is he did he come out the back did i run him over oh the uh the baby that the, that's exactly what i was gonna say the stroller especially <laughs> like the first thing that they do is they have that thing go flying <laughs> like it was just like oh my god and then just the cans crash down and annie's just panicking like oh yeah. i killed the baby i killed the baby <laughs> and jack just had a smile on his face 
he's like, like cans. it's cans, it's cans, you're okay. <laughs> yeah, so, I mean, such a fun movie yeah. from start to finish. Everyone was amazing in it. The action was very intense and realistic, and you're just, like, stressing out constantly of them you know, hitting cars. And I mean, that bus was an absolute tank. It just yeah. took everything out yeah. on its war path. Uh, but the highlight of it for sure is still Jack and Annie. Yeah, absolutely. Jack and Annie's relationship, friendship, everything that kind of came of this was awesome. Annie stayed so cool while she was driving. Like, I mean, Jack full on left the bus. Yeah. And she was still on there just doing good. Oh, that was a huge responsibility. I mean, everyone's yeah. life was in her hands. Yeah. I very much enjoyed this. I would say I would want to see like a sequel. Obviously, you can't really make a sequel to this, but like I would love to see more. I think there is a speed two. Oh, Oh, is there? It might have Sandra, but I don't think it has Keanu. Oh. Yeah, so no, I don't think it would be worth our uh, our troubles to watch Speed 2. Yeah, huh. I don't even know what they would do. I like... think I, I believe it's called Speed 2 Cruise Control, and I think it's on a cruise ship. I believe so. We can look it up Interesting. later. All right. But yeah, no, I don't think it, I don't think anyone liked that movie. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, this is definitely like a, a perfect film mm -hmm. by itself. Yeah, it doesn't need a sequel. I just want to see more Jack and Annie. I think that's what it is. Like, are there more movies where Sandra and Keanu work together? Yeah, we're gonna look, we're gonna have to look that up. Because that's one of my biggest regrets in life is that is Keanu like and Sandra <laughs> Sandra are not a couple in real life. <laughs> I feel responsible. <laughs> Everyone should feel responsible for this travesty. Oh, but I'm pretty sure Keanu Reeves is married. I think they both are mm. or something, but who, who cares? <laughs> But no, I mean, that was, it was so much fun. I'm really excited that we were able to experience this. Yeah, thanks to the patrons for voting. Yeah. And we will be watching The Fugitive because it was so close. Yeah, we'll still be watching The Fugitive and then definitely let us know if there's more Keanu and Sandra movies. Yes. We've seen a lot of recent Keanu movies, like the John Wick movies, Matrix movies. Um, so we've seen those, but I'm sure there's quite a few Keanu movies that we haven't seen, specifically younger ones. Like I think, Point Break, um, Bill and Ted's Excellent Adventure. Like those are movies that we haven't seen. Actually, I've only seen the first Matrix, but- That's the only one you need to see. Yeah, I mean, I can't really imagine watching sequels only on the channel. Yeah, so, but I think there are younger Keanu movies that would be awesome to explore. Mm -hmm. So definitely let us know which ones we should. Yeah. So, but this was great. Yeah, I loved it. So if you'd like to see the full length reaction to this, as well as everything else that we've reacted to, the link to our Patreon is in the description. If you'd like to interact with us on any other types of social media, all those links are in the description as well. And with that, peace everyone. Bye. Bye.